So we're now in round two of this eight man, and Willie yet again fades us, stealing his tack. Yeah. This probably fetches red white. kind of interesting. If my opponent doesn't bolt my Hierarch, um, I'm debating if I'm supposed to just jam Knight. Very possible. Ass I'm just assuming that they have a red land. Um, as long as it's not a ravine, I guess. If it's a ravine, I probably just... Uh, that's what I draw. Because if I don't draw a land, I probably just jam Knight, because I think that the Noble in play to get to Coco is more important. Ooh, Adnaw's combo. So, let's start mathing. I can three. I think Knight's the best play here. Uh, in large part because I think that the play of like double pride mage in the next turn adds so much damage, or just Coco or whatever. I think I just want to be as mana efficient as possible. Oh, anticipate? No, Pentad Prism. Oh, yep, that's dying. Don't really know or care what you're doing with that, but it's dying. Get in the extra damage by attacking first. Put our opponent on a pretty fast clock. So they're on a mana heavy hand. Problem is, I can't keep them off Adnaw's mana next turn. So I'm not going to try to destroy this. I would much rather play around a uh, Phyrexian on life here. Just dead, that's fine. Just get a full deck list. Okay, so this is the spoils list from the GP top eight. And not winning that game. The old turn four kill through two artifact removal spells. with just like naturally having it. I do always make him play it out on Moto too. Definitely won multiple games uh, as a result of people not understanding how to cast Lightning Storm. I think my opponent also messed up by using the Pentad Prism counters, but... It's 
It's a very minor technicality. Exit doesn't matter because they can play another prism off of those lands. Dying on turn four. Well, uh, sure, these cards interact. These cards interact. And this card interacts. These cards do not interact. I think I want to cut multiple companies because I'm... So the debate here is whether Company Defined Thali or Magus is better than Smiter. I think it is. Uh, wait, no. Ooze is worse than Smiter here. I don't think that deck really uses its graveyard a ton. Actually, rather have a Coco than that. I don't think they really have islands, or that many islands to choke. It's very easy for them to just get there with artifact mana. So we'll just try this. Don't think this match is very good. I like this hand. I think this card is very powerful in this matchup. I don't think there's a reason to Arid Mesa there, but it could be wrong. This is the curve I'm going for here. It's a good land for me to see. I think I just want green red. Beat down. The only awkward part well, I'm not gonna get creatures into the graveyard for Goyf anytime soon. Uh I guess Goyf was a two three. I feel like it's not gonna get past a three four next turn. I think the extra damage from this is better. Rest in peace. Well, I'm very glad that Tarmogoyf is not in play now. Um, well, I'm just going to play this creature that has power and toughness. And um, I'm going to hit you very hard with it. Um, yeah, my opponent doesn't have an artifact. There's no like immediate artifact threat. Like a, nothing I really have to handle. I don't. I think my opponent's just dead. I don't really want to show them stony silence. I don't think there's anything that could happen this turn that I die to. Yeah, conveniently, if you go to exactly zero life with that card in play, it does not work out well for you. Or really just taking damage to zero and then that card dying with a pride mage. 
Yeah, the exact zero. I guess the exact zero doesn't matter. Just as long as it dies. I'm thinking of like worship, or I don't know what I'm thinking of. Don't worry about it. I have to take the damage this time. On well, that's convenient that I have all the basics I want. I think I'm best off just jamming the coddles really hard. It's kind of scary. I think I'm just supposed to blood move next turn. I think that likely takes my opponent off of uh, things that matter. Not a guarantee. They could still have untapped land, pentad prism. Uh, they, so they sack bloom for black, untapped land, black, red, pentad prism, white. Uh, that's still okay because they don't have double black. Survivable. Solid Pride Mage is not surviving another turn. That's fine. Sure. Okay, or that happens. Um, who needs cards that matter? I've just got stupid creatures and a hate card. Yeah, well, who needs hate bears when you have hate cats? That's really what it should be.